Well, after warming up a little bit over the last couple days, temperatures are dropping again, which means we've got a chilly weekend around the corner. There is some warmth, though, ahead. In the matter of days, we go from Arctic cold to back above freezing. It'll be the first time in 10 days we managed to get above that freezing point. But as you can see, it could come with some side effects. First up, though, the Arctic chill we find ourselves in again tonight through 9 o'clock tomorrow. We are under a wind chill advisory. That is for wind chills down to 20 below or colder. Could lead to frostbite in as little as 30 minutes if you're not careful. We've been talking about that a lot throughout the course of the week. We've got another night like that ahead for tonight, tomorrow morning. So make sure you got all those winter layers handy because tomorrow morning looking pretty harsh at times. We'll see wind chills down to about minus 20, minus 15 by sunrise. We do manage, as you can see, to get back up into the low teens, a little warmer than today, and we got a lot of sunshine, so that's something to look forward to. That said, wind chill may struggle to get up to around zero before dropping back down again going into tomorrow night, and then we rinse and repeat this into Sunday. As you can see, lots of sunshine. Temperatures are a little warmer. We're closer to 20 degrees. That said, wind chill really doesn't change much. Might even be a slightly colder Sunday morning than back to only around zero going into Sunday afternoon. That said, note the wind direction change. Southerly winds may mean some warmer weather in a big way going into early next week. So going from the upper teens to the low 30s heading into next Monday. But that said, uh, Monday into Tuesday looking like a wintry mess in some regards. We may see a little bit of everything when it comes to precipitation Monday evening. Eventually just the rain snow mix by Tuesday. Either way, you're looking at a glaze of ice at times, especially Monday nights to so be prepared for some slippery roads, some slushy roads, some wet roads at times early on into next week. That said, amounts still varying a little bit, so we'll track the impacts out of this coming over the weekend and into early next week, of course. Early preview has the showers coming in by Monday, and remember this is a whole uh, mix of everything coming down Monday evening into Monday night. Then by Tuesday, it's more of a rain-snow mix, as you can see, and we'll kind of keep dancing back and forth like that throughout Tuesday. And really, the difference between 32 and 33, whether it's at the ground or right above us in uh, the upper atmosphere, that'll make a big determination as to exactly what we get. So be prepared for it. Again, some slower travel conditions between Monday and Tuesday. Temperature wise, though, we're going to be locked into the mid 30s like we were early this month all throughout the rest of next week. That could lead to some more rain showers and only rain for Thursday in your most accurate 10 day forecast. We'll keep rolling with the above freezing temperatures through the end of the month so that Arctic chill may be leaving for a while. What's not leaving is our four degree guarantees streak. Just one off the bullseye today. Cash total rounding out the week at $325. And that's a look at your weather forecast. Your Friday night nets covered starts right now.